Lucy Booth may have inherited a gene from her mother that puts her at greater risk of breast and ovarian cancer, but a new procedure could help her from passing it on to her own children. Doctors in England are celebrating the birth of the first baby genetically selected without the so-called BRCA gene. We've demonstrated now that this can be screened for and we can avoid the transmission of this nasty disease. The procedure is called pre-implantation genetic diagnosis. A British couple used in vitro fertilization to create a number of embryos. When the embryos were about three days old, scientists used a laser to separate a single cell for testing. Only embryos without the gene were implanted. Not all breast cancers are triggered by this genetic mutation, but women who have it have an 80% chance of developing breast cancer, a 60% chance of developing ovarian cancer, and a 50% chance of passing the mutation on to their children. Something 21-year-old Lucy is happy she will be able to prevent. When I decide to have children, I might have the same option as this, to pick the embryos, which do not have the cancer gene. Critics say the procedure raises ethical questions and fear doctors will increasingly screen out perceived defects. But doctors say the benefit of preventing cancers in future generations outweigh those concerns. Terry Okita, CBS News, Los Angeles.